Hey boo, it's your life coach Dia Direct. How you doing? Listen, everybody doesn't believe in telling the truth, but I am a truth teller. And today I want to talk about how the truth will set you free. Literally, the truth will set you free. And here's the thing about the truth. The truth is the truth, whether you follow it or not. Like, it's true that we should drink more water and that water hydrates you. Now, whether or not you do it doesn't make it any less true, right? So, sometimes when we have life experiences and we don't always want to talk about them um, after the fact or you feel like maybe it's too soon, here's what I want you to know that you overcome literally by the word of your testimony. And that's not just from a scriptural basis, but it's something scientifically that's been proven that when you actually speak about something that you've overcome, not only does it give you more courage, it takes away the fear about telling the truth about that thing. It also reveals to you something not only new about your own courage, but it also often put you in a position to help other people, right? And not only do you overcome, but literally by you telling the truth about your testimony, you get the opportunity to be a power mover and a power shaker in the lives of other people where you could literally help somebody else live another day because here we are all on social media showing our fabulous curated lives and nobody's life is perfect and so sometimes even people who are in powerful positions have such an awesome responsibility i think um and position to talk about the times when things don't go as great and to talk about those hard times in your life where you didn't know how you were going to make it or you almost didn't make it but you were able to push through and go forward and take your life to the next level and you discover things about your own resilience and your ability to accomplish more than you could have ever imagined. That's actually why I created the Super Power Podcast because I wanted women of power and women with powerful stories to be able to testify about how they were able to overcome and push through in the fire of life during those times when they didn't know how, but to also not just testify, but to also share tools, like real tools, as to how they were able to get over and overcome. So if you haven't had a chance to check out the Super Power Her podcast, it's Super Power Her with an extra H, okay, because it's about her, but it's also for the men that love us because, you know, I am the man whisperer, and so I often have men engage and really share from their heart so that we can learn from their experiences, right? Here's the other thing I want you to know. Um, a scientist and studies have proven, <clears throat> excuse me, that when you learn new information, you know, some people say you should write it down so that you can retain it. But what's often not talked about but is also proven is that when you speak it aloud, you actually retain it more, right? Because you're able to say it in your own words. And so that's how you know that what you have learned is cemented by your ability to actually speak it. It does something to your brain. And then the last point about speaking the truth. Um, it's really important to make sure that you don't allow your voice to be silenced uh, for so many reasons but when you think about it um, let's say for instance you're talking to a friend or a therapist or somebody like me a life coach and you feel like you need to talk to somebody to talk things through but as you begin to talk about it you begin to realize you have a lot of the solution that you needed you just needed a safe place to say it and so sometimes you just need to hear yourself admit what the problems are, talk about what you're struggling with, um, and really process it out. And when you hear yourself say certain things, you know, haven't you thought about those those times or don't you have those times where it's like, you know, oh, you know what, I know exactly what I need to do. It's just that you've processed it in your head. You just need time to say it aloud. You need time and you need a, a space to to talk to somebody and to hear yourself. But the good news is everything that you need, you really already have. And that too is the truth. And so I want us to stop 
pretending like we don't know what we know, like we don't see what we see, right? That's the things that are good for us and the things that are not good for us. That's the people who are good for us, who are good to us, and those who are not. You know, you can see. I see things through discernment. I see things about people. I know things about myself that I don't always speak. And what I'm saying is, if you're going to do anything, make sure you tell the truth to yourself, number one, and stop pretending like you don't see what you see, like you don't know what you know, because the truth, my friend, will set us free. Tell the truth. What you'll also find out is it's not as bad many times as you think it is. It's just the fear of saying it is what keeps us bound. So. That's my dear directive for the day. Tell the truth. Because it's going to be true whether you say it or not. Feel me? All right. See you on the other side. Until next time, make sure you check out the Superpower Podcast. All right. Bye-bye.